neighbors it's more from truth seeker and I'm gonna show you how to find this little alien this little gray in this big picture you could see to me that looks like some type of American gun you know something you would probably see and you know it looks you could see the tripod coming down you could see the extension there's something sticking up on the barrel as like a, maybe a sight there's his hand coming up you see his head I mean it's it's pretty clear what we're looking at it's a trench that's dug I mean it's there's a lot going on in this little area there's what looks to be like some type of cloth hanging over this you can almost say there's another one behind here but then they just NASA just came in and just blackened this out where the computer did how they left this I have no idea they put some black over here and this here looks to be raised up looks to be a rectangle now from as far back as this is taken I mean that could be you know something covered on there these could be bags on some type of skid or something as you can see they blurred some of it why they would have left this is beyond me I mean there's this crazy thing laying here I mean look at this thing looks to be like some type of metal object with a red center let's see what I could do for you on that that's probably gonna be at the best I can get it there's a lot of that fake see this fake line see how it just comes up but you can almost see what's behind it but look at look at how that line is I mean it's just so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get started but you know what I'm gonna say there's a lot of strange stuff in this little area like this thing this little mask back here gonna blow through some of these real quick I mean look at this thing I mean I believe a lot of this is just fake cover-up just CGI that's all nothing fancy see see how they did this you could see behind it it just looks like a screen See what I mean? How you, how you can see right? I mean, it's just hilarious. It almost looks like fabric. You can see what's behind it. You see how it wraps around that? See, there's a little. I mean, they just darken everything up and pixelate it. You know, most people have no clue what the hell they're. You know, and most people are not. I mean, I got to give NASA a lot of credit because they don't they figured that nobody's doing doing what you know there's a couple people on the internet doing and I'm one of them you know but they they just never banked on anybody doing any of this kind of stuff so uh, you see how they just use the distortion tool it's just pretty easy nothing Nothing fancy here. Yeah. But let me get back to this guy. And I'm just going to start backing out. And we'll show you how to find them. It's pretty easy. You're going to be looking for this area here. Try to keep that in mind. And I'm going to give you one other point. This right here. Okay, you're going to find this, and it's going to be just basically zooming right back from there. Okay, no smoke and mirrors. This is an original NASA photo.
now you see what I mean about the size of this and I'm not even halfway out yet so when I mean I do my homework I do my homework guys this is about what you're gonna want to see on your screen okay you're gonna be looking for this point here okay. that's the point you're gonna to want to zoom to to there. Right. Bada bing bada boom. You're in there. That's what you'll find. Again, one more time. You can also use this as a little bit of a guide. This crazy anomaly back here. All of the, all of them. I mean, it's just you can see there's all types of intricate carvings in this thing. You can take that as an eye, the nose, the mouth. You got to admit this strange thing on the side here. It almost looks like it's got spider webs or something over it. Is this NASA editing a little bit? Who knows? But kind of use that. You'll see all this fake nonsense here. You can see that pretty good. You'll want to see. You'll see that point. Remember this structure here. Billion pixel, rock nest, white balanced. I'll give you the link. And this is just the the image that's not white balanced. Two different NASA images. This is the one that's not white balanced. Features. You gotta check this thing out when you get there too. Look at the doorway in it. Let me bring it up a little for you so we can take a quick look. See this arch that's perfectly cut in this thing? Is this remnants of an old, you know, who knows? And then there's this piece here that's blurred out right in front of it. In this. Now with CGI, they could bury this down. I mean, this could be a structure that goes down. I mean, with the size of this photo and, the, you know, what they have the ability to do. Like, there's this piece that looks like a piece of twisted metal coming up out of there. You know, like this piece here. See this? See how they covered this? I mean, this could all, this is all fake in front of it. See this block that's here? Looks like it's got maybe rebar coming out of it. You see what's sticking out of this block. So, when you're back here, just check out these couple of things. Trust me, truth seeker don't lie to you. I'm only going to tell you the truth. I have nothing to gain by this. Uh, I'm actually going to take. Uh, I'm going to start taking the ads off the channel. I don't even. I don't even care. You know, I figured maybe if I can make, you know, maybe. You know, every two months, maybe like a hundred dollars to. Uh, there's a, a pit bull rescue that I was gonna buy some beds for. You know, but it's just nonsense. It's aggravating me these ads on my videos and stuff. So I'm gonna take them off. I can care less about that. I'll buy the uh, beds for the uh, pit bull rescue myself. You know, I'm a big supporter of uh, rescue pit bulls. You know, if you know anybody that's fighting pit bulls, abusing pit bulls, please, man, stand up and do the right thing and inform the, the, the police or your local pound, please. They're a beautiful breed. It makes no sense to do what you do with them. You know, some people do with them. 
there's a, a bunch of groups out there now that you know grow like the bully breed pit bulls and they use them in pulling ex ex exhibitions I mean they're just amazingly beautiful and strong animals but they're loving and caring and they just get such a bad name man so you know if you know anybody that's doing anything strange to a pit bull man step up and do the right thing be be a man you know do the right thing because uh, abusing an animal man that, that has nothing to do with being uh, you know that has nothing to do with being cool or being a man or being tough or you know tying a dog up in the yard in the heat and the cold no food and hanging them from trees I mean that that has nothing to do with being cool man trust me I've been around, I've done a lot of things in my life. Trust me, man, people don't respect you for that kind of stuff. You know, being a stand-up guy that's honest, your word means everything. People respect that, people think that's cool. So, you know, if you got the time, you know, like once in a while I go walk dogs at my shelter. If you got the time, go, go take one of those dogs out for a walk. Do the truth seeker a favor. If you got a couple dollars extra, give it to your pound. You know, help them out. There's just so many beautiful animals that get, uh, you know, euthanized every day in this country. It's it's a shame. They just want a little love, a home. But man, they'll die for you. They'll die for you. I mean, uh, all of my pit bulls have uh, came. They were either uh, bait dogs or fighting dogs and uh, heavily abused. And I'll tell you, n nothing but love, devotion. You know, I can go on all day about pupils, but uh, you know, I just wanted to get that out there. All right, so basically everybody that was asking me how to get to that point, there's a lot of cool stuff to look at on your way. There he is. It's no CGI, it's the real deal. That's what's there. This is what's going on on Mars. It's a hard fact to swallow. Somehow this got through. Maybe there's a cool guy that works at NASA. Maybe they never figured that out of this picture. <laughs> Some lunatic like me would be looking down to a pinpoint there. I'm out. Enjoy it, guys. True seeker.